Okay, how are we doing out there? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the greater voluminous 4K screen paint using Ambulite Rejection, Technology Gain, times 4, 5, and 7. Uh, I said I was going to do this demonstration tomorrow, but I'm going to get it done today. Just got hit with a bunch of orders, and I got to get on them really quick. All right, so we're doing the demonstration showing you off the difference between a Supreme 7 and everyday black screen paint. I've done this many times before. Now, the screen paint I'm using here up front is a black... Uh, Glitten flat house paint. That's what I'm using right there. And then next to it is the Supreme 7 uh, screen paint. Now, as I said before, when we developed the Supreme 7, we didn't want to, most screen, well, put it away, most screen paints are basically using house paint. We wanted something completely different. We wanted to design our own level of black, uh, the color black, and we wanted something that was going to be different that we can look at a screen and say, hey, look, we know the difference between their technology and somebody else either faking or someone basically uh, just, uh, we do side-by-side -side demonstrations. We can tell which, which paint, which product is ours just by the shade of black. All right, so as you can see, totally both screens look different. This one's black, this one's black, but ours is a bit different. But our screens are jet black. All right, so. First things first, I'm going to do the star field demonstration. As I said before, any screen, you don't inside. As I said before, any screen can pull up black. The problem you have with it is that you have to have both white levels and black levels at the same time. If the screen is pulling up too much black, then what's going to happen is you're going to have a dirty, sturdy screen. Now, usually when I see demonstrations such like this being done on light gray screens, um, when they do this, they do majority all contrast demonstrations. That's why I like to do some light color demonstrations just to show you the white levels uh, next to a lighter gray screen. Or I'll do contrast showing you what you're losing from a light gray screen. So in this demonstration, I'm showing you the difference between our technology and a black, an um, everyday black house paint. Because like I said, I get it from time to time. A customer may say, well, you look, it's no point in buying your screen paint. I can just go out and buy some flat black paint, paint my wall with it, and I can get the same results. All right, show. Sure. So I'm gonna show you in this demonstration where you will not get the same results. Uh, what you will have is a screen that will produce contrast, but your white levels will suffer a, a, just suffer a great deal. And you'll see why white levels are very important. All right, so we're going to come out of here real quick, and I'm going to pull up another demonstration. And this is all going to be on white levels. Now, any videos that I do here, either it's actually copies of each video that I do, that I have done on our Crystal H Technology Screens fan, Facebook fan page, those are live demonstrations. And this is what I mean by white levels are everything when it comes to a black screen. Any screen can produce contrast. A black screen, any black screen can produce contrast. Now there are a lot of black screen paints out there. And like I said, this is one of the demonstrations I would like to see. I would like to see the difference between your black screen and another black screen on high white levels. And as you can see, the Supreme 7 level white levels are absolutely outstanding. And keep in mind the projector I'm using is just 720p, that's it. Ok, 
Okay, now I'm going to grab me a white screen saver. It's white screen saver. Yeah, this is pure white. So this is a white screen saver. This is just pure white. There's no abstract in between, no different colors back and forth. It's just a straight white screen saver. That's what I'm using. So you can see the difference between the two. Using a straight white screen saver. Come over and do a snow demonstration. Oops. That's me. You see a little shadow kicking from the side. That's me pushing over too close to the projector right there. Good look and see exactly what I'm showing you. Let me come over here and move my uh, my cell phone over here. I have my cell phone over here. So that's why I did the demonstration using the straight uh, straight white levels, just showing you exactly what you're really getting. difference in the snow. See how white the snow is here? See how dingy and dirty is here? That's flat black paint. So that's what you get from flat black paint if you try to produce white levels. Like I said, it can pick up contrast. Any black screen will pick up contrast. When it comes to pure white levels, no. Alright, I hope you enjoyed this video demonstration. I'm Kenneth Burr from Illuminates 4K Screen Paint using Ambulite Rejection Technology Gain times 4, 5, and 7. This right here is our Supreme 7 versus Everyday Black Flat House Paint. Showing you the difference between our technology and just everyday black paint. Hope you enjoyed the demonstration. Thank you all for watching.
Sorry, just looking for some videos real quick. Or if you're looking for snow videos. Anything pretty much involving bright whites, stuff like that. That's what I'm kind of looking for, like white snow demonstrations. Not a lot of them, just, just not a lot of them. Wish there were more, but just, just not a lot of them. I do like that white screen saver, just all white screen saver. See, all white screen saver. Just to show you exactly how white the white levels are. Alright, I gotta go. Hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. Thank you all for your time and God bless. Our Illuminous 4K screen paint is available on our website right now, the Supreme and the Superior. I'll be doing some more outside demonstrations. Also, too, uh, we did launch the pre-coated uh, Supreme 7 wallpaper screen. Uh, we're going to be working on outdoor kits, and there's also a summer sale coming up very soon. All right, thank you all for your time.